Hi everyone, Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com coming out to the full case of 2019 Bowman Best Baseball. Eight box, pick your team, number eight. Eight box eight, that's pretty great. There you go, big thanks to all these folks getting into the action here. Thanks Jeff for closing this break out. Double last spot mojo, I think, right? Yeah, Rockies and Giants for him. And thanks to everybody else, of course, for making it happen. All right, there you go. That's a great question, John. I'm glad you asked it while I was on recording so other people can hear it if they're watching this video. What is our schedule next week? We're breaking every day, except for Christmas. So the shop and the stream will be uh, will not be around on the 25th. Possibly abbreviated days for, for, uh, for Christmas Eve. And then same with the following week for New Year's. I think we're breaking all days and open. The shop will be open all days except for the first, obviously, and probably an abbreviated day on the, uh, the night before. You can come visit the shop for this too, ladies and gentlemen. Fourteen oh two Pacific Coast Highway, Hermosa Beach, California, right next to the van store. Free parking in the back. So we're looking at four autographs per box on this, 32 autographs. And remember, as, as per tradition with Bowman's Best, the checklist is generally small, and there's 32 autographs a case, so we tend to, we tend to see repeats. We also tend to see more parallels for specific players you're chasing. We got Dallas and uh, Dallas at Philadelphia. Something's got to give. Dallas has a great home record, road record, and Philadelphia has a great home record. Dallas, of course, without the services of Luka Doncic for a little bit. But does that mean Porzingis kind of kind of gets gets some uh, build some confidence, gets into the action, gets gets this thing going? For entertainment purposes only, ladies and gentlemen, I do have a little bit of financial interest in uh, in this game. Among others, I've got Dallas plus eight at Philadelphia. Going with the going with the dog on this one. All right, good luck, everybody. All card chip in this, from what I've been told, and Dustin May starts us off, Fred. Nice. Oh yeah. And Matt Gomes talking the double header. Folks, if you love this Bowman's best, and I do, I love Dustin May too. Hopefully the Dodgers will be able to hang on to him. Um, there's a double header break of this stuff, if that interests you. Random teams, two full cases. Got a Bo Bichette die cut. Some of those could be uh, numbered as well. And there's Nate Lowe for the Rays. 105 out of 150. Rookie auto for Tampa Bay. Chris Day with the Rays. There you go. I like I like that little bit of negotiation there, Sean. 61 out of 99, Chris Davis. Sean's like, hey, Matt. If you buy into a little break, Kings, maybe he'll return the favor with uh, with the double header. We'll save some of these Vlad Guerrero Juniors and Tatis Juniors as well. We'll sleeve all those up and top load them before they go out. Grant Levine before they're sorted and shipped. Grant Levine for the Rockies. Jeff on the board with one of his last spot mojo teams. Yeah, work together, ladies and gentlemen, like Sean's trying to do. Help each other out. Let's 
shape one of these Senzels too. Everything will ship, of course. In case I miss anything. Got an Atomic Refractor, franchise favorites, and nice, Andrew Vaughn Atomic. 13 out of 25. That is strong. White Sox, that's for Adam Wilson with the White Sox. Top five pick right there. Third overall, I want to say, if I'm not mistaken, off the top of my head. Neophyte Sensations, Josh Bell, and Ozzy Albies. Nice start. Next box. Think that Vlad Jr. die cut out of 25 will go for? I don't know. That's a good question. Yeah, I like that one. Uh, I mean, what are? I don't, I don't keep track of pricing and stuff as often as as uh, as I should. Well, I mean, what are Vlad Jr. regular autos going for? I don't think they'll go for as much as a regular Vlad Jr. autograph out of this set out of 25. But if you get a, if you tell me what that of twenty five seems to be going for, you might be able to kind of guess on a price for the die cut. Good luck, everybody. Yeah, some of those die cuts could be autographed, ladies and gentlemen, so keep an eye out for those. And behind Arenado is going to be Brett Batty. Armando with the Mets. Seth Beer, Future Foundations die cut. And George Kirby, Mariners. That's going to be Tyler Stumpf with the M's. Eloy Jimenez, Neophyte Sensations. And there's Eloy again. We've got Cody Hosey for Fred. Nice autograph. That's the Dodgers' first rounder. Future Foundations, Nolan Gorman die cut. Forty one out of fifty, Victor Victor Mesa. The autograph versions of these are the uh, case hits. They generally fall one per case. And we've got Cal Mitchell for John McCall and the Buckos. There you go. There's Eugenio Suarez to 150, Nico Herner die cut, and of course Josh Bell.
Next box. Yeah, we definitely have time on the schedule to get that double header going, ladies and gentlemen. That would be that would certainly be delightful. Football mixers and single digits, Matthew is correct. Would love to see that happen as well. We got time for both. I think the way our schedule goes, if you look in the if you're watching live, you can see it in the chat. I think we should only be up to around 7.30-ish LA time, 10.30 East Coast time, by the time we get through all these breaks. one. Good luck, everybody. We got Brock Death Rage. Saw him in a Bowman draft a couple years ago, I want to say. So he might be working his way up the ranks, Josh Pruce with the Tigers. Uh, the Breakings, John McCall, is a, uh, a repack product that is exclusively rookies and uh, graded cards as well. It looks pretty cool. We did a football version of it that turned out really nice. Michael Toglia for Jeff and the Rockies. There's Hunter Green. Here's Pete Alonzo, nice, your NL Rookie of the Year. And we got Matt Walner. Twins, that's going to be Tyler and the Twins. There's Pete Alonzo again to 250. Nice, Armando, there you go. A couple of those are pretty nice. The die cut. Key boom. Oh, and Michael Bush snuck up on me here. That's gold refractor apparel. That should be out of 50 or something like that. Nice one for my Dodgers. Dodgers having a nice break, Fred. Fred with the Dodgers. Do a quick autograph recap at the end, too. All right. Next box. After this box, we'll be halfway through. Uh, pick your team number eight, ladies and gentlemen. A couple more sapphires coming up after this. Yes, I will do an autograph recap at the end. We generally do that for breaks that are longer than 30 minutes. Unless it's like a two-hour mixer, then maybe not.
All right. Next box. Let's keep it going. We've got Otani. Power Producers reveals Ton. Tyler O'Neill. Yeah, see? His autograph looks like T-O-N. Ton. I think it's exactly T-O-N. Ton going to Cody Hughes and the St. Louis Cardinals. There you go. It's pretty solid. Eloy Jimenez to 250 is pretty cool. Future Foundations die cut. And Greg Jones is your auto. Green auto, 43 out of 99 for the Rays. Chris Day with the Rays. Steve Olson, what's going on, man? How are you? Let's save a couple of those Eloys, too. CJ Abrams. CJ Abrams and Owen Miller. I saw San Diego. I thought CJ Abrams, but no. Owen Miller, though. That gets Jared Nichter on the board with the Padres. No, I don't think so. I think schedule's in the chat, Steve. I think it sold out afterwards. Tatis Jr. rookie card. Let's save that one, too. And Ronaldo Hernandez. See, there's a atomic version of it. Not numbered, but nice parallel. And Chris Bryant. Nice. 13 out of 50. Thirteen out of fifty. Nice, Chris Bryant. Cubs. Joe Kroll with the Cubbies. Nice. I remember when he was just a prospect in Bowman's Best Baseball. Mackenzie Gore to one fifty. Hyunjin Ryu. All right, four boxes left right here. You can kind of see them right over here. What's the uh, what's the market on Hyunjin Ryu? I've not really heard too many. I think there were some initial trade rumors on him, right? But I haven't heard anything since. I've heard him linked to the... Dodgers and Angels, obviously, the Southern California team. Uh, but I did hear, like, some rumblings about Minnesota maybe kicking the tires on Hyunjin Ryu. Guess is that Hyunjin Ryu, I think, enjoys being on the. Uh, he's a he's he's still a like a bankable superstar in, um, in 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 South Korea. So so maybe he wants to stay on the West Coast. Know, although in this day and age, he's fine anywhere. <laughs> yeah, we did get a new camera. Yes, it is at 60 frames per second. So that which that higher frame rate does give it a little soap opery sort of look, but it's crisp though. And that's the point. We're always trying to improve production value, little by little here at Jaspies. No, Dodgers haven't discussed anything. According to who? According to Sean Corbett Times. On Corbett on sports. All right, Seth Beer. Still Astros edition in this set. 
That goes to Andrew and the Astros. Andrew Herman and the Astros. Pete Alonzo, rookie. Oh, then there's C.J. Abrams. There he is. That'll go to Jared Nichter and the Friars. All right, there you go. Oh, is that right, Vanilla Gorilla? Um, oddly enough, we copied other breakers going seven nights a week and using Nightbot, so... I don't think it's anything new. And there's Bryson Stott. Randy's asking, when does random Bowman start? Do we have a random Bowman on the site? Or are you talking about Bowman's best doubleheader, Randy? If that's the case, it starts... Uh, I guess it'll 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 go when it fills. I don't know if it's full yet. Yeah, there are nine teams left. That's the nine random spots left. So it'll go when it sells out. Not <laughs> don't listen to Sean. Five out of 25, Andrew Vaughn, orange. Keston rookies. So yeah, whenever it sells out, we'll add it to the schedule. We're booked up until uh, 7.30 Pacific. And there is a die cut autograph. Four out of 80, Future Foundation's Alec Baum. That's pretty cool. That goes to Tyler and the Phillies. So let's say it sells out in the next, before anything else sells out, it would go into that 7.30 time slot that you see in the chat. LA time. Mackenzie Gore. All right, and the next one. So by the time's all said and done, I'm gonna probably squeeze in a little, uh, quick little food break after this break. And then we'll come back and knock out a couple sapphires. Then we'll do optic random teams. Then we'll go through some more orders and then we'll figure out how we're gonna close out the night. Cause as it stands now, we still have about two and a half hours left in the show by the time we get all these breaks done and everything. So plenty of time for for everything on the site. Schedule's in the chat, Brandon. That's about 6.30ish LA time, 9.30ish East Coast. It was his pop. That was yesterday. I have to counteract the calories today. Nice, Brandon. Thank you. Yeah, I haven't gone through... Uh, I still need to go through another round of orders, so I don't know who's buying what and what looks like it's going to be close to selling out, but we'll figure that out in the next hour or so and start to add more breaks to the schedule, hopefully, and then we'll see what happens. All right. Good luck, everybody. Here's the next round of stuff here, next box. 
And we've got Julio Rodriguez for the M's. 57 out of 150. That's Tyler, right? Tyler. Been hitting nicely in this break. Oh, then, then I would be eating nothing, Sean. Uh, Brandon says, I can't tell by your profile pic because it's tiny on my screen. But what are we are we looking for? A, oh, that looks like someone with a number 12 on it. Are there any good players with, who are number 12? Reese Hines, Reds. That'll be for TJ and the Reds. There you go, TJ. Well, unfortunately, we have no control over the randomizer, Brandon. You would just have to uh, you just have to cross your fingers. You would have to talk to Rand.org. Well, welcome, Randy. First break with us, huh? Good luck. A lot of times, new cu there is a sort of new customer mojo, new guy mojo. Has, it's definitely a thing here. So maybe you'll be the beneficiary of something like that. All right, Vlad Guerrero Jr. and Daniel Espino. That will be for the Tribe. That's going to Paul Harris. There you go, Paul. And there's the focus right there. We're just talking about him. There's Hyunjin Ryu to 150. Die cut. And ton, Tyler O'Neill, Cody Hughes, 41 out of 99. And there's Carter Keyboom. Two boxes to go. Um, okay, Randy. I'm probably not going to remember that. There's way too many names for me, names for me to keep track of, but... We'll cross that bridge when we get there. All right, second to last box, good luck. Next to last box, second to last box. I use those use those JBL true wireless headphones, ladies and gentlemen, earbuds. Does that, would that make me would that make me play like Giannis? Probably right. What's up, Irvin? What's going on? There's John Duplantier. That goes to Ian. I sure will. I sure will recap autos at the end. Rookie auto for Ian and the Diamondbacks. Green Mackenzie Gore to 99. Franco die cut. Eloy rookie and Luis Gill, old Gill. Remember, remember old Gill on a uh, on the Simpsons. That'll be for Yervin and the Yankees. 
First hit for Yervin, so just in time. There's a die cut right there. Pete Alonzo, Tatis Jr. Josh Bell. And Shane Langliers. Langliers, 112 out of 150. Mark Bear with the Braves. Uh, Victor Victor die cut. And we've got Jared Kalanick. Tyler, nice break for you, man. Another one for the M's. A little bit of Bowman best pixie dust on there, but I guess it's just going, going with it. I don't want to really touch the card, but there it is. That little bit of pixie dust is just going to go with Jared all the way to Tyler. Tatis Jr. to 250. Nice. Chris Davis, Atomic, and Glaber Day. And the final box. Good luck, everybody. Anyone have anybody in their neighborhood that goes really nuts with the uh, with the Christmas lights? No, no one seen, in our neighborhood seems to be doing too much here. Because our area, we're just just behind our shop, right? There's all all residential. There's there's a house with some icicle lights. Those look pretty cool, but that's about it. We got some lights right right at our front door, and then obviously around the studio window here. Got a tree, got a snowman. I think there's a neighborhood around here that, or there is a neighborhood that goes through. There's all sorts of like a whole avenue of homes with all these great lights. I don't know if I would want to. Do you want to buy? A future home that's in a neighborhood where where the neighborhood's really intense about Christmas lights. Would you want? To, would we want to be in that situation? Now, the pressure to keep up with the Joneses would be would be a little too much. Rebel says, as long, as long as they don't expect me to go all out, then sure. Yervin says, I'm that guy. The neighbors call me Mr. Griswold. Yeah, traffic gets bad in those neighborhoods, John. Yeah, when I'm looking for houses, when I'm actually a grown-up and can look for something like that, um... I'll definitely ask the real estate agents. Just like, what's the what's the Christmas vibe here? And if it's too intense, I may pass on this neighborhood. All right, last box, ladies and gentlemen. Last four autographs. We got a Jake Bowers auto. Paul Harris with the tribe. There we go. There's the Dean Kramer die cut for the O's. Vlad Guerrero, Nick Senzel, and Wander Franco is your case hit. Franchise favorites, Wander Franco. That is nice. That is 84 out of 120. Nice. Chris Day with the Rays. Is there is there a big lighting setup in Chino Hills? 
Chino Hills is a nice area. 16 out of 25, Boba Shet. And behind Bryce Harper is Zach Thompson, Cardinals, Cody Hughes. All right, there you go. All of your shipments, Sean? Maybe there's some that have not left the shop yet. Tatis Jr. die cut. That's pretty neat. I like those die cuts this year. A little bit of a heavier card stock, too, so they're feel like they're a little more sturdy. There's Julio Rodriguez, Atomic die cut. And we got George Kirby, another Mariner for Tyler. There you go. When it rains, it pours in Seattle. Yeah, a little more variety in this case, I feel like. It's pretty nice. Well, a lot of one, a lot of one team, it seems like, but there's still some different, different things happening here, which I like. There you go. All right, and there you have it, ladies and gentlemen. Pick your team eight, eight box eight in the books. 2019 Bowman's best baseball. That's what it was. Oh, quick autograph recap. For breaks over half an hour, we try to do try to remember to do these. Apologies if we don't. Nice case hit. Yeah, I don't think we've seen too many tons here. Julio Rodriguez was kind of new. So was Alec Baum. Chris Bryant was a nice autograph out of here. Owen Miller. Michael Bush. I think we had a CJ Abram back there somewhere. Hosey, Brett, Andrew, Grant, Dustin. So a lot of cool stuff there, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you for getting into the action. We'll see you next time. This is Joe. We'll see you for the next one. Bye-bye.